So the shot is altered a little bit, and it you remember you used to have the counter from where yeah. the puck shot is. The counter used to be, you remember that, Mike, anyway, it used to be flat, and that the custodian's uniform, I believe, was dark, wasn't it? Very smart with a dark, flat cap, peak cap, oh, yeah. just inside yeah, I there. I can't remember, because Uncle Charlie mm. was custodian That's why he was there as well, yes, because he used to take over from Joe for quite a lot. Yeah. Uh, Charlie did, didn't he? Yeah. Then they would have the fire going there sometimes, Joe would. Yeah. Very often had the fire going. They used to have a suit of armour where the custodian's desk is. And uh, swords and armour hanging up from the walls. And uh, uh, for a certain, for a period of time, because some of those were pinched. I, and uh, yeah, I think we Don't should. Look at me. No, no, I just, I just, I just there's, I thought there's a collective bubble then, of, uh, we think, but I was gonna, wasn't going to go that far. <laughs> no, there was, uh, there was armour and swords there. They had pikes there, didn't they? Yes, long yeah. pikes. I don't know if my memory serves me right, but didn't they have big muskets up there on stands? Yes, they did. For a while? The, the gun, that's right, the muskets were all pointing out windows. And they were on stands. That's right. Big, big muskets. That's right, yes, they were, were, yeah, yeah, you're right, yeah, yeah. They, they were there. We were told that the dungeon was, uh, there was a dungeon here, yeah. and that were all bad people, which it isn't, it's an oubliette. Oh, right. Because uh, you can, if you go down there, you can look into the oubliette there. Oh, right. A room to forget, because if you remember it just up the, the hatch instead of the see-through thing you've got there. Yeah, yeah. We had the hatch, didn't we? We were covered, yeah. didn't we? Yeah, yeah, just, yeah. Yeah, the oubliette. We, we always called it a dungeon We did, because that's what they, we were told, weren't we? We were all, we liked the, you know, we used to go up here and you mustn't do that, because if you're bad, you'll go down into the dungeon. And there's no such always these yarns you're told. Yeah. So what did they use that room for? It would have been for, for basically, if a dr uh, say a soldier was found drunk or um, fell asleep on duty, you'd have just simply lifted the hatch up, dropped him down, huh. closed the hatch down, bye bye, there you are until you served your time. Then they just pull him up by rope or something, oh. probably by rope. Goodness. Do you remember Dory Joe? Yes. Yeah. yeah. She was, she was, she was, she was Yes, Sergeant Major Jewel, he was probably the last family to live in the castle, which is why they built the chimneys. All oh, right. And Doreen, uh, Doreen lived in my auntie's cottage just after Janet and Keith Ferris got married. They were the oh, first right. ones in there. Yeah. Doreen lived here no, with, her, with her parents. They got pikes. And the oh, idea yeah. of it was simply yeah. because yeah. Um, this was from about 1822, they had chimneys. And this is because as the like high-ranking officers were coming towards the end of their duty, they would take over the castle with their families and live here. So that's why they bought the, uh, put the chimneys up. When the castle came, in, came under the uh, Ministry of Works and uh, after the war, uh, these were deemed unsuitable because they weren't in keeping with the period. So they, but uh, I, I'm sure it's, I'm sure Sar it was Sergeant Major, I was correcting on the other day, that actually was the last family who lived in this castle. Uh, there's Garnet there now, we'll show you some good photographs. When did you start collecting these? Um Photos, oh, I've been collecting photographs, of, photos of St. Moore's for a long, long time. I got about 300, something like that. Can you remember what started you off? Yes, I went into a second-hand shop in Ledbury, and there was three postcards of St. Moore's, and that started me off. And you weren't expecting to find them? No, yeah, now I spend vast amount of money on them. Lovely. Too much, <laughs> far too much. Yes, I knew she was. <laughs> Can't remember. <laughs> Dorothy's. Um... Oh, we used to be up here all the time. You think your dad put his initials up here? Oh, he might have. He might have somewhere, but you can hardly find them there. That is lovely. Oh, we used to spend so much time up here on us Saturdays and. It's a wonderful playground. It was beautiful. Playing tag and hide and seek. You have about 20 kids up here running around. There's loads on this, this wall as well, here. On that yeah. side. Let's see. Yeah. There's a 
1855. Oh so there is. 1855. Now that is early. DC. Mm. I wonder if any of the soldiers put theirs on it. Werner, with a triangle. You did put it in the wood. Oh, I appeared it. Is it? Oh, yeah, that's all right. 1981. 1981, was it? Breaking. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'd come up here one day when they were cutting the mortars and tunnels out. And I'd put 14 pound sledgehammer smacking to us, chisel. You know, when you came over and chisel yeah. it, yeah. <laughs> it's amazing the work I put in there, and it's now starting to look good. It's now starting to it looks open, open, open up and yeah. look old. Yeah. Cause you could smell the oak from outside when they done it. it was... National news, didn't That's it? Right, yeah. National news about two castles r war. Now you must remember that, Mike. I, remember I think you were there, weren't you? Day. I yeah. That day. I know a lot about that. Day. And Donald was there then, because Donald got the campaign to bring it back, and eventually, after this it news, day off, right? it was his day off, wasn't it? Yeah, it, it was his day off when they pinched it or borrowed it, as they say. They took it away. They were told to take it away. They took it away. <laughs> they took it away. <laughs> Plain and simple. <laughs> they probably asked me to pay for it to tell them to do it. <laughs> yeah. Well, you remember the football club used to have their fights up here? I remember them having the football out here. They used to kick the football through the tyre. And they used to have the fastest yeah. drinking pint. They used to drink the pint the fastest. I know Yvonne and I used to have the sweet store. They yeah. this top lawn. I remember that. I remember yeah. having um, dipping for golf, um, um, the golf or something. Or, but no, I remember the foot, they had the football club used to have their fights here. Yeah, yeah, yeah sure there was hundreds of people living in some of those Well, there was, yeah. 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 They were absolutely immaculate. All the banks were. We weren't allowed to go down the, down the banks. We no, you were now slide down. No, no. You didn't know what. You wouldn't do that. Oh, no, no, not me, Mike. No. No. <laughs> we used to roll down the banks, and the older ones used to push us back down the gate, and then. Joe were rather playing hell or Mike or some of the gangs would play hell with you for doing that because you'd flatten the daffodils or something if I were up. But we used to come down that way. Don't you bloody well get it? Go on, up, beep, 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 you know. Well, where we were, Joe, uh, Leonard Ambrose was the custodian then. That's what I keep saying, yeah. Eric. I don't know why. It's, but Leonard, yeah, yeah Leonard, yeah. And you right. wouldn't dare do anything because a booming voice would say, Get off! <laughs> <laughs> you had a booming voice. <laughs> no, I can just about remember, remember it. Again. No, no, you wouldn't no, remember just that. Remember. No. He used to go around with his open top car picking up the big spill from the hotels. Oh, that's you right, yeah. 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 That's where the original, well, a goldfish pond was anyway. And before that, it around about 1922 or so, was, it was an old wash house used by troops and the custodian at the time. <laughs> this is where we all used to come out, uh, usually through, from the beach, through the block house. And we used to come up around the stairs with a plastic bag and go down and pitch goldfish. There used to be some steps going down through here, about here, and there used to be like a, like a very, very thin pathway that you could walk around, and it come to a dead, dead end, and then come back up. One or two people have actually fallen in it, including my uncle. This is one of the places where we used to come down sometimes and hide in, in one of the little rooms, and when the visitors used to come out, we used to come out and... Uh, there would be 
held ago when we used to get pooped out by Joe. There was a gun emplacement, what we called the dungeon, ammunition store down there. That's right, that, uh, part of that was covered over for ages. Yeah, but yeah. he didn't like us going down there, so there used to be red lighting going down there. And he used to tell us it was blood from the old soldiers. <laughs> and if you put your finger across it, it would come up looking red and look like blood. And you go, look, look, blood from the old soldiers. Don't you come down here, he said, they, you know, <laughs> Anything to keep us out. <laughs>